It's interesting that they're the two best show players because they both play like different from each other, but they both get like really good results regardless. I mean, that's you know that's what the Monado allows you to do. It just allows for ten different play styles within one character. But let's see how Tarek does. He's made it really far in his super stacked tournaments, so he's got to be pretty good. Pokemon Trainer. Of course, I, I don't know anyone that doesn't start Squirtle. I mean, I guess, like, you want to start the match off just immediately, like, overwhelming your opponent with combos. Right. There were some people, I think, who just wanted to start with Ivysaur to get an immediate Nair combo, but after the 4.0.0 nerfs to him, I, I don't think those people exist anymore. Yeah, Ivysaur was hit pretty hard with the nerfs. He was, and, you know, of course we got compensatory Charizard buffs to really even it out, but yeah. not the character he once was. Now, I wonder if that's going to affect a lot for uh, Pokemon trainers going into the tournament this weekend, or even, you know, Tarek. And he still made it really far this tournament anyway. He has. Uh, this is, I believe, loser's quarters, so, you know, had to make it... Or no, it's uh, loser's eights, so... <laughs> Whatever the case, these are, you know, two two of the remaining players out of a tough, tough field. And, yeah. you know, they've proven their mettle to get this far. Man, this last... seems pretty hard for a squirrel to deal with the sword of Shulk. Like, he just doesn't have the range to contest what Shulk can do. Certainly doesn't. And already with the Smash Art on deck, Komei wants to stop now. Although I like the delay from Tarek just to get rid of the Smash Art. Yeah, that's actually really smart. A lot of people don't do that to just stop the Monado Arts, depending on which one he has. Yeah, we see it, you know, it, it's sort of been popularized with waiting out Arsene, but of course you can do the same thing with Shulk's Art. Again, good spacing from Kone. He's making it really difficult for him to get in, honestly. Of course, the downside to stalling is that he may get the Smash Rock back. Although yeah. catches him with a re-grab, and yeah, Komei yeah. will take a stock early. Tarek already in trouble. Oh, nice. Back throw back here with Charizard. Oh, but he can't get the hit he wants. Nice. Good ledge presence there. He's keeping him exactly where he wants him. Charizard's super big, so he's going to have to deal with these sword hitboxes more than usual. Oh man, he's trying to get a, that, another back throw back Misses here. This is the tech, and now Tarek's yeah, in trouble. That's, that's just already gone. out of a second stock. Dang. Kome is flying for this set. Yeah, he went really aggressive with the back here off stage and uh, paid for it with his life there. Unfortunately, not in position to tech there. Yeah. I don't know. I feel like if you're going to go aggressive off stage, you always have to be ready to tech like that. Just need your finger on the shoulder button. And now he's got shield art, too. Yeah, it's always scary when Shulk's up like so many stocks on you and then he pulls up the shield art as well just to make his stock even more healthy now he's just gonna outdance you know all of what Tarek has to offer okay so gonna go for the fourth throw oh nice yeah Komei waited for it to use his jump to the very last moment that whole time but Tarek still sniped him out of it that was actually a really good edge guard yeah it it looks like he wanted to just bait him out at jumping early with an air, but good patience from Tarek and will be rewarded with the stock. Still kind of has a mountain to climb here. Shulk can live for a very long time in this situation. He can, yeah. especially with an available shield art. Oh, so scary. Okay, he wants it now. The back air almost doing it across the stage. Okay, nice. Water gun or hydro pump. I don't know which one it is, but he still finds himself off stage. Up air? No, he couldn't connect the combo he wanted. Oh, nice. He didn't commit to the second air slash, but still gets a little decent punish here. Uh, I think he wanted to use Shield Arts to try to intercept the low percent combo. Perhaps. Are we going to see Komei? No, he's just opting to keep stage control, and I like it's a wise move from him. Just doesn't have to play like that when he's ahead. Can I just make this comeback, though? Komei's playing so patient. Waited out the up smash as well, oh. and now the smash arc. I don't want to see a ledge re grab again. Oh, wow, he actually let him get away with that. I thought he was going to forward him at the ledge again, but I guess he was too far away to punish. 
Yeah, Tarek was low on ledge invincibility here, but Shomei just waited him out. Oh, no sweet spot on the back air, so he's going to be able to live. Oh, now you got to do a shield art. I would, okay, I was going to say I would wait it out, but it doesn't matter. You still got the back air out and got the two stock for good measure. Yeah, really good for Kome. He definitely knows what he's doing in this matchup. And uh, not, can't, I don't know, I can't say I, I can say the same for uh, Tarek, honestly. Yeah. But uh, I don't know, this matchup just seems pretty difficult. Like Squirtle just looks like he just struggles a lot versus Shulk. And uh, Cohen's playing around Ivysaur really well. Then you just have Charizard, just like a pretty much a punching bag for Shulk's hitboxes. Yeah, pretty much. Kome just rocked that from start to finish. As you said, Charizard is just such a large target. And with someone with hitboxes as large as Shulk does, Kome will be, you know, swinging wildly. And even managing to, you know, even trading will be working in his favor if he has the right art on deck. <laughs> Let's see if Terra can adapt. Still has a, it's still his best two out three range. So if there's any time for him to figure out what to do against Komei, it's now. So uh, let's see what we can do on Kalos here. Starts with the back throw. Although now Terra you know, has to take advantage of moments like these where he has stage control because they've been few and far between so far. Yeah. Oh my goodness, Buster does so much percent. He really does, and you know, I hesitate to say this, but 63% might be kill percent with Smash Art. Yeah, on Squirtle, yeah, Squirtle's really heavy. Like right there, if he got like a Smash Art fair in this situation, it could probably kill. Oh, oh, he didn't get the spike. Man, that's so unfortunate. Actually, he might have been able to just tech into the stage there. Keep forgetting that Kalos is, uh, lends itself to surviving spikes pretty well. It does. Of course, the Ooh. forward smash comes in from Kome. That will seal out Terex first stock. Only 47% taken. Didn't even have to use an art as well. Nice. That was a really good parry punish. And uh, pretty much finds himself in the same situation as the last game. Down early. Okay. I uh, like what Terex's doing here. He's not really letting him abuse that he has bust art. Basically, like, you don't want to let Shulk get free punishes while he has that because he does so much percent. He can snowball a match really easily. But uh, he's going to do a little bit more to get this stock. Yeah, Terry is just believing in Squirtle at these high percents. Kome above 100 into the triple digits, but even keeping out a character with perhaps lesser kill potential. Yeah, it's uh, not easy to kill early with Squirtle. You have to, like, get some like jab blocks to four smashes or just a really deep, like, Aerial off stage, but it's really rough for him to even get in on this character now this in the first arc place. Out. That's oh. a re grab, so it does have to be careful. Has his back oh facing the stage in the back so air from patient. Kome. So what patient. Absolutely waited it out, and as that ledge invincibility ran out, Tarek was just panicking and chose the wrong getup option. Oh man, Kone is applying so much pressure at the ledge right now. He did so much percent, even without Buster. But nice, up smash out of shield. It's actually not easy to punish. Buster aerials on shield just because of uh, the added shield stun from uh, this mechanic of Buster art in general. But switching the shield to see if you can intercept these low percent combos. It's like something that's always hard about dealing with Shulk just because your normal setups won't work in those situations. So you have to kind of improvise what you want to do. Wants to go for it all there with the F smash. Has to avoid these razor leaves in the meantime. The jump art comes Ooh. out on deck. This might give him the onus to go off stage. Oh man, he's still got the air slash out in time. Good punish. Even though he crossed up his shield with the neutral, he still got it. And another re grab. He's trying to wait out of the air dodge. That up air from Shulk, very dangerous, even without like stat boost of the Monado arts. And look at Kome, he's just walking away, playing very defensively, waiting for that smash art to become available once more. So patient, playing around these hitboxes just from Ivysaur. Oh. Now it is the Smash Art comes out. Okay, he's going to stall the Smash Art as long as possible. Gets the trump, but doesn't find anything off it. But Eric Slash, not quite either, and it's already gone. Yeah, that was good patience there from Tarek, but still he's going to have to do so much more to bring it back in this situation. Still really far behind. Back throw. He's looking for that back air, but Kome recognizes this, stalls his recovery. 
Okay, where's he gonna go now? Yeah, oh my goodness, the Smash Art is so dangerous in this situation. But he goes off stage. Kome could just sneeze on him with Smash Art at this point, and that might be the game, but good stalling from Tarek. Waits it out, and that Nair almost landed with Smash Art active. That might have spelled the end if it did. Oh my goodness, so far, off the stage. Oh man, good timing of the up because he was vulnerable after hitting the stage with the side B, but where's he gonna go, man? This oh, is the tag, and that'll spell the end of it. Komei with a second two stock of the yeah. set. 2 0 over Tarek. Yeah, that was uh, untechable at the end there. So even if he did want to tech that air slash, couldn't do anything about it. Right. But uh, 